dear students today my class is 8th class max chapter 3 understanding quadrilaterals exercise 3.4 before going to this class kindly sus subscribe king classroom for max and computer online classes now coming to the exercise 3.4 chapter 3 first problem state whether true or false given conditions are a to h they are conditions so solution here the shapes true or false and raise first one a all rectangles are squares false a rectangle need not have all sides are equal hence it is a, not a square so second one all rhombus are parallelograms rhombus are parallelograms true since the opposite sides of the rhombus are equal and parallel to each other it is also a parallelogram okay all squares are rhombuses and are also rectangulars rectangles true all squares are rhombuses are all are sides of a square are equal equal lengths all side squares are uh, also rectangles and each internal angle is 90 degrees d all squares are not parallelograms false because the opposite sides of a parallelogram are of equal length hence squares with all sides are equal are parallelograms all kites are kites are rhombuses false a rhombus has all sides of equal length whereas kite does not have all sides of equal length all f, f all rhombuses are kites true since all rhombuses have equal sides and diagonal bisect each other all parallelograms are trapeziums g true true since all trapeziums have a pair of parallel parallel sides which is true for parallelograms as well as well h, h all squares are trapeziums true all trapeziums have a pair of parallel sides hence all sides all hence all squares can be trapeziums okay second problem identify all the quadrilaterals that have four sides of a equal length four right angle triangles first one four sides of equal length rhombus and square are the quadrilaterals with four sides of equal length okay rhombus and quadrilateral and square of quadrilaterals with four sides are equal length four right angles square square and rectangle are the quadrilaterals with four right angles here four right angles this one right angle means 90 degrees below are the diagram shown for square rhombus and rectangle this one square this one rhombus and this one rectangle explain how a square third one explain how a square is quadrilateral a parallelogram and a fourth one rhombuses and rectangle step solution step quadrilateral a square square is a quadrilateral since it has four sides good parallelogram property uh, opposite sides are equal Uh, a square is a parallelogram since it is it contains both pairs of opposite sides which are equal opposite angles are equal so opposite angles are equal and diagonals bisect each other one uh, bisect one another so and its diagonal bisects each other rhombus properties a rhombus is a parallelogram with all sides of equal length square is a rhombus since uh, first one all sides all four sides of the uh, same length the diagonal of the rhombus are perpendicular bisect of one another the diagonals of uh, 
square are perpendicular bisect of one another fourth one rectangle properties being a parallelogram the rectangle has opposite sides of equal length and its opposite sides are equal length a square is a rectangle since each interior angle measure 90 degrees so the second one diagonals bisect each other and opposite angles are 90 degrees opposite sides of equal arc uh, equal length and uh, its diagonals bisect each other all interior angles are 90 degrees fourth one name the quadrilateral whose diagonals bisect each other and are parallel bisectors of each other are equal three conditions name the parallelograms first first one bisect each other the diagonals of parallelogram rhombus rectangle square bisect each other same parallelogram like this this one this one this one this one equal bisect each other rhombus like this all sides are equal and bisect each other rectangles parallel sides are equal all are right angles and bisect each other and square all sides are equal all are right angle triangles rhombus parallelogram and rectangle square second one are perpendicular bisect each other the diagonals of the square and uh, uh, rhombus are perpendicular by bisect each other perpendicular diagonals are perpendicular in rhombus bisect each other square are perpendicular bisect each other this one diagonal perpendicular this two this perpendicular this two this perpendicular are equal third property equal the diagonals of rectangles and uh, squares are equal rectangles and squares this one this one diagonals are equal and this one this one diagonals are equal square fifth problem explain why rectangle is convex quadrilateral solution polygons that are convex have no portions of their diagonals in their exteriors also all the interior angles of convex quadrilateral are less than 180 degrees a rectangle is a convex quadrilateral since its vertex are raised and both of its diagonals lie in its interior also each interior angles of rectangle measures 90 degrees okay hence none of uh, angles is a reflex angle so a rectangle is considered a convex quadrilateral like this one rectangle is considered as a convex quadrilateral okay sixth one abc abc is a right angle triangle and o is a midpoint of side opposite to the right angle explain why o is equidistant from a to b and c the dotted lines are drawn additional to help you okay so diagram observe the diagram this one parallelogram rectangle solution a b c d is a rectangle opposite sides are equal and parallel to each other and all interior angles are measured 90 so a b a d a B equals to BC and uh, AB equals to DC. This one is equal to DC and AD equals to BC. AD equals to BC and uh, AB equals to DC. AD is parallel to BC. AB is parallel to DC. So equal. In rectangle, the diagonals are equal length and they bisect each other and they bisect each other so hence a a o is equal to o c is equals to b o is equals to o d a o equals to o c equals to b o is equal to o d thus two right angle makes a rectangle 
whose where o is a is an equidistant point from a b c d because o is the midpoint of a two midpoint of the two diagonals of the right angle a b c d here midpoint of the a b c d of the rectangle a b c d therefore o is equidistant from a b c d okay thanks to watch complete video like the video share the video and subscribe the channel thank you